Condo prices are lower this month in Manhattan. In this video, I'll cover how the local market's performing and where it's headed. I'm Justin Braithwaite, Principal Real Estate Broker at Braithwaite Realty. Number one, sales prices. In Manhattan, the median sales price is currently 1.62 million, down from 1.76 million last month. This is the first month over month decrease after four months of increases. Our recent peak was 1.86 million in May of 2022, and our recent low was 1.495 million earlier this year in February. Number two, the sales price to list price ratio. Right now, we're at 93.4%, down from 94.4% last month. The higher this percentage, the higher the sales price is compared to the asking price. Our recent high was 97% last June, and our low was 93% in March. Before we go further, if you're finding this information useful, consider subscribing so you won't miss my videos each month, and you'll have the latest facts on the Manhattan condo market. And also, if you or anyone you know would like to buy or sell a condo, just reach out and we'll do everything we can to get you what you're looking for. Number three, days on market, which tells us how long, on average, it takes to go from listing to contract. We're at 129 days, up from 117 days last month. Our recent high was 139 days in March, and our recent low was 83 days last July. Around 120 days is considered a balanced market. Number four, the number of condos for sale. There are currently 3,846 condos for sale, down from 4,104 last month. This is the fourth consecutive month of decreasing inventory after five consecutive months of increasing inventory to start the year. Number five, the number of price reductions. 8% of sellers reduced their asking prices last month, down from 11% the previous month. Our recent low was 5% last December, and our high was 14% in May. Price decreases are a leading indicator, so this is another positive sign for prices going forward. So in summary, a mixed month for the Manhattan condo market. On the positive side, the number of condos for sale and price reductions are both down. On the negative side, the median sales price is down, the sales price to list price ratio is down, and days on market is up. Based on the inventory continuing to decrease and the number of price reductions decreasing, I believe we're headed for price increases in the coming months. If you found this information useful and you haven't already, hit the subscribe button so you'll have the latest facts on the Manhattan condo market each and every month. And also remember, if you or anyone you know would like to buy or sell a home, just reach out and we'll do everything we can to get you what you're looking for. Thanks for watching. Until next month.